What do you call french fries and gravy and cheese curds on a cracker? Poutine on a Ritz. Anyway. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> Bravo. Clap, claps for you. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> uh, I forgot about that. <laughs> Grab with the laugh. Thank you for that. <laughs> it's like a sitcom. Poutine on a Ritz. Ha ha ha. <laughs> All right. So we're jumping back into this. We are at the very end, I believe. I don't need y'all. I got the sound effects. <laughs> I feel like every single time from like here on out, you're just going to tell a joke and just end it with the sound effects. <laughs> uh, command. Channel point. I can't. I can't think right now. All right. How do I play this again? <laughs> Maybe I will. Don't tell me what to do. Alright, so if you don't know where we left on that, gladly explain. In case you don't want to hear spoilers, don't hear. <laughs> what do you think, audience? <laughs> they love it. They really love it. <laughs> it's like finally someone will laugh at my jokes I'm kidding I always love your jokes but for this joke to work it has to go the other way but I truly love your jokes also that was an accident but I'll take it Anyway, the other way. <laughs> ha ha ha. Alright, I gotta kill y'all. I love the screw attack in this game. It is fantastic. I feel like I can just jump around and take anyone out that I ever wanted to take out by just simply spinning. It's like Smash Brothers but overpowered. And I approve. Does say it's not gonna work? Okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, we're around the story. Uh, as far as I know, we're in area eight. Uh, there's this big little robot monster looking thing that we've been following around this entire game that we ended up finishing off. Finally, so we're done with it. Trying to see if we can get up there. Um, so that monster's dead. We got to this area, and there's only one more Metroid. That's pretty much it. It's really not too much to tell from the story. This game has very minimal story to tell, which is fine. Yeah, Nintendo. They just keep it as simple as possible with just really fun gameplay. But yeah, so we killed an Iron Giant. We got an upgrades. That was a word. And now we're here. And now I'm trying to figure out how to get to this, which I think I know how to. There we go. Power bomb tank. Sweet. <laughs> I'm glad you found it enjoyable. Thank you. <laughs> That's my story. Oh, 
Okay. <laughs> Thought I was gonna have another word there, but I did not. So it's just an okay. Oh jeez. Like, do I have any more ammo? Oh jeez. So how was your day? It wasn't that bad. I know it's a great way to start it. I, uh, what did I do today? I worked. <laughs> Pretty much most of my day. Um, but it was a good work day. I, I didn't hate it. It was, it was a little slow, but it was good. Also just trying to figure out where I need to go. I guess I need to go there. Is there an upgrade? There's an upgrade I skipped. Yeah, I had work. Uh, I had a co-worker try to peer pressure me into going to our company picnic tomorrow and participate in a cornhole competition. Uh, I decided not to. Also, oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, wait. This might be a hard upgrade to get to. I'm going to get to that. Nailed it. All right. All right. Winding down for the weekend. <laughs> uh, man, my week's just starting technically. Like, today's like my Tuesday. <laughs> so I start my work. My work week start on Tuesday and they end on Saturdays. And I have my Mondays and my Tuesday or my Sundays and my Mondays off. So technically today was like a Tuesday for me. So I got, I got a bit more in my work week. But I'm getting through like the tough stretch. After tomorrow, it's kind of easy because I get to work for more the rest of the week after that. So I'm not just happy to get rid of through the stressful days. Today is probably the most stressful of my days. It's like most work I have to get done. But the rest of the week shouldn't be too bad. I wish I could wind down though. <laughs> You any good at cornhole? I know I'm not. I have not played cornhole in ages, so probably not. <laughs> I'm gonna go for this. Huh. All right. Is there anything to break? Anything to break? Anything to break? There's nothing to break. Except for over there. That's so weird. <laughs> you got this. Thank you. Oh, jeez. Um. Oh. Yeah, I have a feeling. Wait, so it's all this breakable? Trying to figure out how to get through this, I'm like, there's nowhere to get through. That's fine. Yeah, I got through the tough stretch today. Uh, worst part was I ended up running into the CEO of my company, and on my on my, on my work break, I ran into him. Oh my god, crap! And he's trying to recruit everyone for our picnic tomorrow as well and trying to get everyone to be like, oh, you gotta, you gotta participate in the cornhole competition. How can, how, how can you say no to your, your, your CEO? Your boss is one thing. That's my thing. Your boss is one thing. Your CEO of a company, it's another. Uh, I, I worked my way around it. I uh, essentially just told him, yeah, I'll sign up. Let me let me think about it. <laughs> and then I got lunch. <laughs> I 
Is this the cornhole comp? It's the cornhole competition on company time. It is. And they said you do get paid for it. So it sounds all great. My concern is I feel like I would get backed up with work if I go to it. And I don't want to fall. Jeez, oh don't want to fall behind on work. And I don't know where it actually is. <laughs> oh yeah, put me in coach. I'm ready. I just wasn't really in. I don't know. I just don't want to fall behind on work. As, as far as I know, like half of us aren't even going. Because <laughs> I think we're all in the same boat where like we just don't want to fall behind. <laughs> yeah, they say it was on company time. You, I think it's for like a couple hours and then we go back to work the rest of the day after that. I wasn't feeling it. <laughs> What is this? We're near the Metroid. This feels like something's about to happen. I call me crazy. <laughs> Actually don't. But I'm on Moz by am the best beanbag tosser you'll ever meet. Oh, it's on. <laughs> Ian, you must stay one on one. Every okay, actually, something's happening. It's a Metroid, like a regular. Oh crap! I'm like, what's happening? Can I actually fight it? Oh wait, ice gun? Yep. <laughs> Damn it. Might lose. <laughs> it's a tough veteran. Why do you just go from one to ten? I'm, I'm confused. <laughs> I'll watch. You really want to take that challenge on, bro? Oh, dude. You don't even realize how badly you're going to lose. Like, it's not even going to be close. Do you realize? Do you? The mic drop? If I could actually drop this mic and it wasn't on an arm, I would. Arm drop? What? Alright, anyway. <laughs> that was corny as hell. <laughs> Where am I? Alright, I killed a Metroid. <laughs> Sheesh, the confidence this guy has. How many beers? <laughs> oh, thanks. Thanks for these, like, pity claps. <laughs> uh, how many beers? Not enough. Die. How are you? Okay, you have to supercharge. I think Stick be trying to make a bet. A bet he can't win. Where are all these metrics coming from? If I'm being completely honest. I will try one of each. Gotta make sure there's no poison, right? You're welcome. All right. <laughs> what is happening? If I win, you owe me a sour bomb. What's a sour bomb again? 
listen, my brain's not all the way there. I'm, oh, fuck. And so it seems. Alright, we're good. Sour bomb. This sounds very familiar. I don't think I've ever had a sour bomb. Can you eat a sour bomb? First question. It's like a car bomb, but sour with shaft. Oh, boy. Okay, maybe I have. <laughs> I think I've had a car bomb. No, wait. I feel like it's like a Jaeger bomb. <laughs> now I'm thinking of like that old, uh, I'm thinking like beginning. Oh, I'm putting this down. I don't care. I'm thinking like beginning of time YouTube. I <laughs> love me and a <laughs> nice. Um, the YouTube guy who like he's a dick. Obviously, in the video, I'm just gonna let this go. It's fine. Um, give it a sec. All right, we're good. <laughs> uh, but the guy who like go around with like a white top, mustache. We he was a dick in the videos. But you always talk about like he's like this badass guy. You always talk about like drinking like Jager bombs. <laughs> talk about Jager bombs, Jager bombs, Jager bombs. Like he's always in the zone. <laughs> Don't know if anyone remembers this guy. This is like I was probably like 15 years ago. I would say maybe 20 years. It's like beginning of time YouTube. <laughs> this guy was amazing to me. Nope. All right. It's fine. <laughs> Looking back at it now, it probably doesn't look very funny. To, but to me, I w as a kid, I remember Will It Blend. Do I remember Will It Blend? Also, why do I feel like this is like a name of a person? I'm good with Jaeger. <laughs> Don't breathe this. Haha. <laughs> This is like... I don't know what's happening. <laughs> and there's more Metroids down there. I guess more up there too? This guy's just like, not now chief, I'm in the fucking zone. Like something like that. That's just one of the things I remember is him just being like that and then talking about like he wants to be in like great shape. So he's talking about like, uh, you know, he needs his muscle milk. And then he's going around complaining to his mother about where his muscle milk is. It's just like, ma, where's my muscle milk? I need my protein. And he talks about like all of his like HGH and his protein and his power bars. Just me? Okay. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. What's happening? Hey, hey, what's happening? <laughs> I can't go back. All right. I mean, I can, but. I actually do not know what's going to be like the head monster here. Like end game stuff. Like I know nothing. It makes me interested. Unless it's just like, it's, I got a feeling it's going to be like a giant Metroid. Something. I think we're about to fight the final boss. Potentially. It feels that way. Am 
All right, something's happened. What the fuck is that? It's gonna be Ridley, obviously, or Creed. I was thinking one of the two, at least Ridley. What the fuck is that? It's definitely not a Metroid Prime. A <laughs> dog Metroid. <laughs> Clearly. I don't know. I'm gonna die here. Oh. Hey, can I shoot in his mouth? No. Alright. Did you shoot missiles? Missiles in the mouth. I feel like. I know my Nintendo games is either you shoot them in the eye or you shoot them in the mouth. Missiles in the mouth in the name of them? Yeah. Oh, wait. I wasn't ready. Got a counter? I'm gonna die here for certain. How are you supposed to dodge that? There's no way you're dodging that. Unless maybe I have to like spire up the wall. <laughs> Just get good. Thanks, Llama. Also, how you doing, Llama? Oh, that wasn't really. So whenever it opens his mouth. Damn it. Oh no. I could probably. Ah, whatever, it's too late. Ow. I'm like literally about to die already. She has math again? Suck it. Oh wait. Grab it. There you go. Pull you down. I mean, I'm doing better. I'm gonna die, it's, which is fine. Yeah, I figured as much. <laughs> Sephiroth. <laughs> uh, I'm positively, absolutely, without a doubt, just okay. Okay. What about you? I'm also kind of the same way. Oh, this plant dog does a lot of damage. Yeah. This game has been pretty brutal. I mean, for a Metroid game, this game's been pretty brutal. I've only ever played Metroid Zero Mission. Like the 2D ones. Compared to Zero Mission, this game's way brutal. Way more brutal. I think it's like the difficulty than normal. I don't know. Fusion Mission was brutal too. I still have to play that one. That's on, that's on my list to play. Probably got a shot in the mouth there. Oh crap. Grab my missiles. Alright, let's see. Pull you down. Shoot a couple of missiles in your mouth. Ow. <laughs> I wonder if this is actually a thing that's been a. Uh... Oh, wait. What am I doing? That was dumb. This part I don't get. So I feel like. I need to like, and then like, maybe this? Oh, thanks. Such a brutal boss. I'm dead. <laughs> I 
it's so brutal. But that's because I was like eight when I played it. <laughs> oh, okay. Really yeah, counter green things? No, it won't work. Because the only way you can melee counter if like that, like glow happens, then you can melee counter. Um, but if it doesn't happen, like that's also a cheap shot. Like, come on. Also, I'm just like missing all my super missiles. There's gotta be like another method to hurt it. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, crap. I probably could have hit it there. It's fine. Alright, that works. Quack. So, like, only, only there you can do, uh. Ah, oh, fuck. I have, like, one super missile left. I was kind of hoping maybe I could just shoot it. I'm get, I'm thinking you have to do it like this. Dodge it like that, and then try to find. Yeah, like that. Alright. Hopefully that'll work. This game's all about remembering patterns. It's like Hollow Knight. <laughs> I mean, Metroid Venus, whatever, but you know. Thank you for the quack number. Oh. Oh crap. <laughs> How are you supposed to dodge that? Like this I finally got the hang of. Maybe. I'm starting to thaw. like this part. I can't figure out how to dodge that yet. It's that scream part. I feel like I have to be as close to it as I possibly can, maybe even underneath it. When that happens, I'm just not timing it right. Oh crap. Maybe you turn to a ball for screams a part of your aerodynamics? Maybe. Could try it. I might open that mouth. Oh crap. Alright. Doing a lot better without the sun. Pull you down, blast in your mouth. Ow. <laughs> yeah, at this point, it's just like going to our morph ball. Wait for this. Alright. Get over here. Fall. Alright, cool. They still learned how to dodge that. Alright, here we go. I feel like I'm going to try getting underneath it. Oh! Well, I might have... I might be something. I felt like I almost got sucked into its mouth. I wonder if that's actually a good thing. Like, if I could drop, like, a morph ball bomb into its mouth. Oh, wait. What am I doing? I messed up. <laughs> I don't think the ball helped. I have an idea. Oh crap. Hey, right, I don't know. I have an idea of what to do. Worst part is I'm probably not even close to its final phase yet.
Oh, wait. Damn it. <laughs> can you grapple something? There's nothing to grapple. Because the only way you can grapple is if you do... <laughs> Thank you, Ace. <laughs> The only way you can grapple is like something like red clothes. Like this part I get. This part is actually pretty much easy at this point. I can just kind of chill here. I always do it the harder way, but. Oh, wait. <laughs> Super easy, by the way. I might go get hit. So like that and like there, so that little red dot there, that's why I can grapple. There's nothing to grapple on them. And if you try getting under them or behind them, it's not gonna work well. There's like nothing to grapple. And I can't shoot missiles. Because they'll just deflect. Wonder if maybe I can do like a like a power bomb? Or maybe just shooting in its mouth when it's doing it somehow. Like just God, I'm crying out loud. I should be able to hit it there. Hey maybe does this work? It does work. Ah well. Roll for dexterity. That's a good roll. Yeah, I can't grapple it. I'm crying out loud. Alright, let's about to do it again. At this point, I'm like, I just want to shoot as many times as I possibly can. Like, can I? No. I think the ball does help a little bit. Like, not much. But if I'm close enough when it starts doing it and I start rolling normally, I could avoid it. So I did it the one time. And I did try it out the first time. Like, it worked. I mean, I'll take a 14. 14 still a good roll. Wait, what if you turn into a ball and stick to the floor? Never thought about that. I could possibly do that. I could try it. I'm not sure if I'll stick. That is a good idea. Alright, I'll try that next. That actually might be it. <laughs> might be onto something there. Yeah, he, oh crap. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I thought I messed up. I'm like, I'll get out of here. Oh. I do enjoy the fact that the, the little green balls do stay in the same pattern all the time. Alright, I'll give it a try here. Yep, that's it. I should figure that out. <laughs> I probably I probably would have eventually. I've been like, ah, oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> I didn't even think about the sticky wall thing. <laughs> Big brain llama. Yeah. Oh crap, what is that? <laughs> my, my brain's so wrinkly. <laughs> Jesus, guy. I wish I could just like 
shoot something in its mouth, though. I feel like it can. But I don't want to be overly aggressive. <laughs> Like every single missile. Also, I don't. There we go. Let me learn how to aim. <laughs> so I can do this. Uh, why am I not grabbing? Thank you. I feel like I gotta do it like one more time, maybe. There we go. That's a little better. Just start the ceiling. Yep. I gotta learn this whole thing. Alright. Hurry, 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 hurry. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> That's that one I can easily dodge. I might have to get onto the roof early. I think that's what I need to do. So, all right, this is a normal way. Oh, and then fall. Ow, I ran to that one. How many more missiles do you have in your own man? <laughs> Ow. Alright. Oh. He's like mixing all of his attacks together now. Hey Mel, like how you doing? Might have something. Pull you down. Damn. I'm trying to figure out like how many more shots does this thing have in them? It's already red. There we go. Just changing it up, yeah. Trying to bag extra still on my 3DS. But GG's. Was it even three shots? No, it must be five. I feel like there's more. No more Metroids. Or just three, but a little bit more. Yeah. Nintendo's like, we're bluffing. Yeah, we're just kidding. It's three. <laughs> Sand egg. Is this the BB Metro I've always heard about? The baby? Okay, I've always heard about this. I know nothing about it. Is this how we become a mommy? Holy shit, it's Metro Prime. Sam is like, I just became a mother. <laughs> It's the baby from the music video, yeah. Aww. Aww. <laughs> All right, that was good timing. We, we and mommy. All right, cool. I'm gonna call you baby. Oh. oh. This whole time, BRB, okay. I will protect this baby with my life. Y'all need to back off. It's 
So we've killed every single Metroid except for the last one. I'm guessing this is the last one, but this one's just like, where is it? Like, it's, you, you know nothing about me. I was just born. I want this baby to start sicking all of them. And just be my weapon of a mass destruction. <laughs> So this entire time I have not been able to get through these rocks and the find out that all I needed was a little baby Metroid to do it. Changes everything. <laughs> I'm the baby, guy love me. You're not the mama. <laughs> Are you Samus? Not the Samus. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, eat your rocks. Eat your rocks, you're hungry today. You were just literally born like three minutes ago. You need your food. Get your protein. <laughs> Get that muscle milk. HGH. Protein power bars. It's a great dumb video. That was a great introductory video for me growing up. Of the stupidity in, in the world <laughs> and how entertaining it is. Alright, we're all stocked up. I might have phrased that wrong, but it's fine. <laughs> Suck. Oh, jeez. There's still like a whole thing in this game still have to do. I thought that was the end. <laughs> we're not even near the end. As far as I know. We're still going. I want this baby Metroid to be like gigantic. Just eating all the rocks by the end of this. Eat up. Come on. Get your potassium. Maybe that's what it's like. It's like potassium. What? You can slow time? Yep. Nom nom nom. Uh, in this game, you can slow time. Yeah. So there's an ability. You learn abilities. So I could technically like use this ability to look at my map radar. And actually see things, which is freaking awesome. <laughs> Might I add. Um, and I'm going to miss that once I get into Super Metroid. But you can do stuff like that. Uh, you can have like a shield. Which is like a temporary armor. It's not that strong. That's a temporary armor. That's OP. It really is. But honestly, it saves me so much time. I am not going to argue. Um, yeah, there's that. Oh, we're going back to the beginning. I guess we're trying to get out of here. Maybe this is what's going to lead to Super Metroid then. Well, I mean, actually it does. But just like the events that happen here. I don't know what happens in Super Metroid. Yet. I will get to it. Um, <laughs> congrats, you win. You saved the babe. The entire time, this entire game... All we did was just murder like 50-ish Metroids just to get to the final one and be like, you know what? I'm going to save you. You're an infant Metroid. You don't know better. You're not attacking me. Maybe Samus is like, I'm going to raise this Metroid to become a bounty hunter. Watch out.
So I think we're fighting a lot of the like early game enemies too. Let's see what's here. Oh, destroy this! Destroy it! Eat up! Come on, eat, eat! Come on! I guess we gotta be wallowing, maybe. I don't know. Just want to when I'm near here. I have to be like in the area. There you go. Eat more. Come on. A little bit more. No. Alright. Whatever. Uh, have all these muscle milk rocks been here since the beginning of the and the baby matrix opening up new paths? Exactly. Yeah, the, those rocks have been there since the very beginning of the game. And I have not been able to figure them out. And it turns out all... At this point, I think you can just go to everywhere in the game. Just use the baby Metroid to unlock it. Or I guess if I head this way, I'm head to the end of the game. So I'm pretty sure we're heading back to our ship. Because we're, we're back into like the very beginning area of the game. So I have not been back here in a very long time. Oh, it's over here. Teleporter? Yep. Oh, also, there's teleporters. <laughs> like, so many things in this game. <laughs> so many quality of life options they added in this one. I'm just like, oh, thank goodness. That's different. The game like we mad you walking out of the Metroid. Hey, this is not what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, this is not what good. Wow, did we exterminate the Metroid? It's time to go home. The X, the asterisk. I'm just gonna keep climbing around, flying around. I love this ability so much. I should be able to do this in Super Smash Brothers, I'm just saying. <laughs> like the amount of jumping I can do here, I should be able to just do it unlimited. Kirby can do it, but I can't see this. Also, I'm just gonna go back to the door. It's so good, it's so good in the games, yeah. Oh, jeez. Uh, is this only for an upgrade? Yeah. Huh. Could get this. Let's try. Maybe. Makes sense, but too bad she can't fly. Yeah. Okay. Pull myself up. I got a feeling this is about to be like a time thing, so I'm just gonna make a run for it. Yep. <laughs> it does come too well at this point. But you can slow down time to get through here a lot faster, and if you don't get through there fast, then you're gonna fall. But those ion tanks are what I use to upgrade Samus with her abilities that she can use. It's bigger now, whatever that means. <laughs> so that's for everything like if I'm doing like slowing down time or checking my map or anything like that, that's that yellow bar. And uh, that's what's used to power it. And then when you kill enemies, you can recover along with like your missiles and everything. It's like the yellow stuff. It's your uh, Aeon, Ion, or however it's pronounced. I feel like something bad's about to happen. Yeah, something's about to happen. There's our ship.
the beam at choice. Like, I'm gonna go. Going in, Ma. It is Ridley. It's always Ridley. So Ridley died in the first game, I thought. So Ridley dies in every game. Who am I kidding? Baby, yeah, I know. <laughs> touch the baby. Also, I think I'm gonna die. This is it's actually kind of tough. I'm trying to figure out how to dodge the attacks. Okay, I dodged it. I see the tail. A right, tail attack. Like that part, it's like, and this. Oh, uh, okay. Baby free. <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh, uh, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Ace. Samus. Yeah, I mean, that's too easy. Samus, get out of there. <laughs> there we go again. I have like one health. I got me to die. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not gonna live. Same as ain't no chump. Oh shoot, either is really. Ridley's actually kind of tough in this game. All right, we're all set. Just want to prepare myself better. All right, we're good. I guess two. Alright, got that pattern down. Clearly I didn't dodge that, but I got it down. <laughs> Except for other yeah, that's true too. We don't talk about that. It's actually a good remix of the theme too. It's like, seriously, you can't have a Metroid game without Ridley, right? <laughs> he Ridley has to be there. I do enjoy that Ridley is like slowly starting to look like Mecha Ridley. Oh, it's only... Okay. What is that? Okay, missiles are pretty much useless at this point. Well, I mean, we're getting down with the pattern, so I'm good with that. 
I need to uh, just memorize it a little bit better. Like, essentially get out of this phase without taking damage. <laughs> First off. I already fell in that degree. <laughs> I'm already doing worse, so here we are. I want to redo already. Actually, maybe I should start using those abilities I have. Like, I'm really not even using this at all. I'm just going to like straight up offense. It's starting to change red. Oh crap. Honestly, I think I should have saved my ammo in the beginning. I have a plan. <laughs> I can save my super missiles in the beginning. Can I go with my ion stuff? And then use super missiles later on. Also, I am not dodging that good at all. Or that. <laughs> or that. <laughs> Or this. There's none of that right now. What am I doing? <laughs> Getting hit by everything is what I'm doing. Can I really just, just restart? <laughs> Other M really was easy too, though. Wait, no, I was thinking Metroid Prime 3. 3 was pretty easy. I remember 3. Other M, I remember a little bit. Could you see? Mm -hmm. Shit. I need to be dodging better. Like, I am definitely not. I'm dodging better now, but before, like, early on, I did horrible. Oh, crap, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm, like, not jumping now. Uh, how come you never use super bombs? I feel like I don't have the time to use them. I was thinking, I, that was the thing I was mentioning, or I was mentioning in my head. <laughs> I was thinking about using them when I'm on the ground. When Ridley's on the ground, but I'm, like, I'm not sure if I have the time to put them out. Oh, my Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm like not even, I'm just not ready. Mentally I feel ready, but I'm really not mentally ready. <laughs> Fuck me. I'm really not ready. <laughs> Going into this, I'm like, I feel ready. <laughs> You're just not a pro metro. Like, oh, cool. Sick. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even know if they even did damage. Maybe I did? I don't think it's really hurting him that much. <laughs> Good.
Oh. <laughs> I am like, I'm not sure if I'm ready. I might have to start just shooting. Oh wait, what am I doing? I then started doing this. Got him. That's a grab like Smash Bros. He does. Damn. Go be my sure and save me. Like suck the yeah, go baby. What is that? Just really strong claws. <laughs> that was dumb. Baby, say back. Oh, I am paying attention at this point. Like, when you get a corner over there, like, how are you supposed to dodge that? <laughs> like, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, so just like any other Nintendo boss. I said maybe last time, three stages. <laughs> you were doing so good? Yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. I should have the first two stages down at this point. As long as I don't mess this up. So I messed up. <laughs> I think I heal a little bit. And then near the end of that third and final round. Like the baby heals you a little. Oh crap. Oh. I'm just gonna shoot. I feel like at this point I do better in the first or the second round than I do in the first round. Clearly I'm holding up to that argument at the moment, but here I am. Just wasted all that ammo. But yeah, it doesn't look like the super bombs hurt really. <laughs> like the super missiles do. But the thing about the super missiles too is like you can shoot the super missiles anywhere at Ridley and he'll take damage. If you're using regular missiles, um you're not doing damage. <laughs> oh crap. Also I just jumped right into that. I also just walked right into that. I feel like it's just like so slow I can't time it. There we go. And I think the Super Mario is helping. <laughs> this makes me want to play this game. This game's fun. I didn't realize how like dramatic this final boss is gonna be. Yeah, if this is even the final boss, who knows? Feels like a final boss, though. If we're trying to get to the ship. Oh, crap. Typically, I'm waiting for like a planet to blow up or something. <laughs> In this case, we're just trying to get off of it. I 
Alright, it's almost into the next phase. Because that's the only way you can really tell you're doing damage. Is the color of the enemy. It's like they changed to like a redder color. And Ridley's getting very close. There we go. This is making me want to play this game. Like how you couldn't be Hollow Knight. Hey, I did eventually be Hollow Knight. Be real, I did beat it. It just took a little while. Look at that baby though being an MVP here. Like draining Ridley giving me health. Yeah, it does give me health. Cool. I was, I was trying to make sure I'm like, did it actually give me health? By trying to... What is that? A crab. That reminds me of Smash Bros. with that grab. What we got? Maybe? Might just be draining him. Okay. This battle is epic. <laughs> I wish I could look. I'm sorry. Am I trying to make sure it's not? It's not gonna like. Uh, it's about to. Happen. It's just like missiles. Okay. I ran right into that. It's almost there. I am in full concentration mode. <laughs> there we go. Maybe. I don't think it's dead yet. <laughs> Jesus. I could have countered them. That might have been it. If I countered Ridley there. I need to end it with a melee counter. Baby suck. Yeah. How about now? He'll just be back next game. Oh my kidding. <laughs> Like Ridley, you're too important. <laughs> More like Ridley sucks. Am I right? Let's see what you did there. Do we do it? I'm afraid to put my 3DS down. <laughs> no, I kind of want to. GG's. <laughs> so really was the final boss. See if I can put this down. Okay, cool. That was fun. Yeah, GG's. I kind of figured we'd finish early. That was a good... That was a good ending. I really liked that ending. That was a fun final boss. I didn't realize like, Ridley was going to have like three different phases. So we got the baby Metroid. That explains a lot leading into Super Metroid. So I know there's stuff about the baby Metroid in it. Uh, 
Yeah, so essentially the game, as far as I could tell, it was just exterminate the Metroids except for the last one. It ended up being the baby Metroid. So I'm guessing whatever that giant monster was that we fought near the end before Ridley was probably the monster kind of like converting the Metroids into like whatever it is, I think. Or I'm thinking it was like the Space Pirates. I think they mentioned like the Space Pirates were mutating the Metroids. And maybe that's what happened out of their mutations. But Sam was just like, I'm just going to take care of them all. <laughs> and then that leads into the next one. That was fun. I enjoyed this. Hope you all enjoyed it too. Difficult. <laughs> for a Metro game, like, this is pretty difficult for a 2D one. If Dread's going to be this hard, I'm going to die a lot. Yeah, I have a feeling it's gonna be. That guy was a pain in the butt. That little big mecha robot thing. Fun boss. Pain in the butt. <laughs> Droid will almost certainly be more. I have a feeling. I'm probably gonna dread it. It would be disappointing if it isn't. Yeah. It most definitely will be. I'm thinking about this game length, maybe a little bit longer. <laughs> dread it, get it. Metroid Dread. I did like the little 3D visual we went to, like very briefly looking at the baby Metroid, because it reminded me a lot of Metroid Prime. Which, I still miss Metroid Prime. <laughs> But overall, I, this was this is fun. I really enjoyed this. Okay, so I'm assuming I don't know how Super Metroid starts exactly. You don't start with the baby, do you? Baby? I don't remember. No. Wait, I think I know. I think the baby's experimented on it? Maybe I forget. I'm pretty sure it's a bad thing though. <laughs> I, won't, I don't want I don't want it no more. It's Super Metroid next. It is. I might take a quick break from Metroid and play something else in between. And then start Super Metroid. Cause I've played Metroid Fusion and now I've played this. Not Fusion. I've played uh, Metroid Zero Mission. Cause I'm actually trying to play the games sort of in a chronological order and chronological has it as zero mission then this then super metroid and then fusion oh god i was about to say you played fusion without me no not yet that's the last one okay so we beat the game in about 11 hours how many deaths <laughs> gotta be near the hundreds no Oh, see you next mission. Yeah, it's like typically how the game ends. Now, Fusion's going to be the last one. We probably won't play Fusion for a couple weeks still. But I know the next two Metroids will probably take as long as... Maybe a little bit longer than how long this one was. This was pretty long for a Metroid game. 2D mode. Because Zero Mission was only like... I think I finished it in like 8 hours? That's the one I finished in just under 11. And I think the other two are about like 5 or 6 each. I think. Maybe like eight hours. I think Super Metroid is a little longer than Fusion. Or something like that. I forget. Like I know they're not super long games. <laughs> I finished Fusion in 30 minutes. Well, good for you. I'm kidding. That's right. I'm the world record holder. Congratulations, Lama. I am proud of you, though. I was going to say, I do wonder if there's like a hitting ending. What is that? What is that? The parasite? The fuck's the parasite? <laughs>
I'm guessing this is like a feature Metroid game that I'm about to play, so okay. <laughs> hard mode has been unlocked. You can select it when you start a new game. Hard mode? That wasn't even hard mode? I uh, can now use Metroid related amiibo to unlock new content in the gallery. Do you have amiibos? Uh, you can access the amiibo menu from the map menu or the same as file screen. How hard is hard mode? <laughs> Bro, you have to beat the game to use Amiibo? Lame. Yeah, actually, I'm surprised. I didn't think you had to. So I beat the game 44%. I think I was around... What was I around like... Was I around like 60% for Zero Mission? I only get 44% with this one. This game had a lot of like post-game content. Or like extra things to find. All right. So that's uh, that's uh, zero. That's uh, that's uh, that's Samus Returns. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> I had a really good time though. So let's. All right, let's get back to the just change screen for a sec. Because I actually finished that a lot earlier than I thought I would finish it. <laughs> My yeah, I was crazy now when I play Dread. I'm actually looking forward to Dread now even more playing this game. I think now I have to get into the mindset knowing that Super Metroid and Metroid Fusion are not going to be this type of gameplay. <laughs> like difficult, well not difficulty, probably still difficult. But uh, like the style of uh, Metroid, like melee counters and all that, I'm like that stuff's not going to exist. <laughs> yeah, I love Fusion. I'm looking forward to it. Because I want to play Fusion last, because that's the one that takes place. Then you say it's before Dread. So that's why I want to play Fusion last. But yeah, I'm playing them all like chronological. That's why I'm playing them the specific ways I'm playing them. So that's why I did Zero Mission first, because that's a remake of the first one. Uh, this was a remake of the second Metroid. And then the next two. Keep that end scene in mind when you play Fusion. Okay. I like the continuity. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. I guess the first game didn't really have continuity. It's zero mission. I mean, it was the first Metro game. Like you beat it, you move on. <laughs> uh, I just hated the end stuff in Zero Mission. Other than that, I enjoyed the game nevertheless. Like, I felt like I finally saw enemies. And I was like, you know what? I've heard about these enemies so long. I'm finally experiencing them, and there's not Ridley. And I think any Metro game has continuity, I guess the Prime games. These these games do. I mean, obviously, like, the Parasite going to be in Fusion, I suppose. And, like, this baby Metroid is going to appear, I believe, in the next... I'm pretty sure Super Metroid has something to do with the baby. And then the Prime games are all continuity. And then there's other M. Ignore that one. <laughs> well, yeah, the new ones. Big Me is more excited for Dread. Dread comes out in October. Yeah, I already pre-ordered it. I pre-ordered it like as soon as E3 happened. <laughs> I immediately jumped on that thing. I kind of wanted to get the special edition, but that, that sold out like immediately. The only other M is Fusion. Please. Quack. Hey, number. Alright, so we're done with Alright, so we're done with Samus Returns. I have 